being fat, even though it is our COVID time, that doesn't mean you can't throw a wicked Halloween party, right? So why not throw you a cute little party and invite some cute little friends? So I'm gonna show you guys how to they make this mummy, our skeleton, and Mr. Jack landed down here. And we're gonna get right into that video, guys. For our other friend, we're gonna go ahead and color our icing. I have already started coloring my orange. So for this orange, because I use um the Sunnyside Up Bakery, which you can get from Hobby Lobby. I use this, so this took actually nine drops of the orange to get that right kind of pumpkin-y orange color. Alright, so now the orange is done. Let's put this aside for a second. Let's do our green. So we got orange, green, and black, and then white. Okay, for our little friends here. Our white is our detail for our mommy. So, 
So we're gonna, first of all, when you got piping tips, you have our piping tips here. The easiest thing to do with piping tips, especially if you have a color that you need in the bag, um, and that you're gonna pipe on for a cupcake for like your base. So like for our money base, it's gonna be black. So what I'm gonna do is add what we call a coupler to our bag.
pumpkin that has its own little curves right so we're going to try to curve it around this way then we're going to get it on this side here curve it down and if we get it right then we'll actually see a little curves here and then straight down the middle you see this way it's not a lot of buttercream you guys are not having a lot of buttercream if you don't like a lot of icing so see just like that see, just like that so we're going to take our no. so we're going to take our black and we're going to draw him a little fist as best as you can a jack o is up to your own interpretation of a face you know I would say it just becomes from a pumpkin to a jack o lantern once you put eyes and a mouth on it so Now his mouth is going to be the interesting part, okay? His mouth, I'm we're going to try to do this. 
and there we go okay so there we go that is our fist for our so now we're going to pop them on some leaves for it's going to look like his hair so let's pop on that leaf there get on there and stay come on now there we go let's do it like this There we go. And there is our little Jack. Our little boy Jack is complete and ready to go party. Okay, so let's put him over to the side. So now, next, we're going to show we're going to glue our little skeleton, okay? We're going to do our little skeleton. And let's get our white base going. So you want to basically just get your little white base going here. Go around just like that. And what you're going to do is this. Once you get your base, you want to take a little small spatula and just flatten it out. Okay. I'll just flatten them out. Here we go. I don't know why I'm holding it. I'm so used to just holding cupcakes and decorating, guys. So we're going to just flatten them out. That's the reason I have my turntable. And we want to just flatten out his edges over here, straighten out his edges. on your spatula or your knife if you do not have a spatula guys let me repeat this you do not have to have a small spatula okay you can do this with a regular butter knife and it really does not have to be perfect because when it's a party who really cares you know when it's a party they they just want to eat most people just want to come go oh my god that's so cute and eat so we're going to go here. We're going to go nose first. At least that way we can figure out what we're going to put. So two slits for our nose. Squeeze for your eyes. Just like that. And then our smile. I'm going to go down. A little, you know, a little smile. And then what we're going to do is put our little stitches in it like Somebody sewed his mouth shut before he, yeah, he was talking too much, and apparently, and they sewed his mouth shut. I'll do just like that. So go from one end, squeeze a little bit. Just, just pick it up. All right, and there is our little skeleton, all ready for the party. Sometimes if you, if you realize that one eye is bigger than the other, it's okay to go back and fix it. <laughs> All right. So next, we're going to, last but not least, we're going to go for our boy, Mummy. Okay? For our little Mummy boy. So, you want to take off your piping tip. So now you just need the black. So take your black, go around, just like we did with the white. Go around. This time you want to take your spatula and you want to flatten it out. And see how our black got a little bit darker from when it looked like in the bowl? And your black is going to look darker. So if you make this icing in advance, you can make your icing in advance, right? Just put it in an air like container top and you can make your icing way in advance especially black and your black will get a lot darker okay so that's the fun part now we got that next we got some candy eyes okay all you need to go for candy eyes 
any cake supply store, Walmart, uh, Hobby Lobby. I got these cute little candy eyes here. Y'all can see my hands are like, just, I like, yeah. And these cute little candy eyes here. So we're gonna pop them on. One and two. All right. So now we're gonna take our white bag with our tip. And with the tip with the white bag, you wanna try to find one with a flat, but also has like little ridges on the top. So that way they'll kind of look like bandages. So. Then I go, and this is just however you want to lay them. You know, your bandages can lay however you want to lay them on your mummy. Just cover them up. That's all you want to do. See, just move them around a little bit. And you want the rough side to the top, your little ridge side to the top. Okay, cover everything but his eyes. Okay. Um, I didn't go around all the way around, so you just kind of want to overlap a few times. It's up to you how you overlap and where you overlap. No mummy was wrapped the same, right? Yeah. No mummy was wrapped the same. All right, so now he is ready. So no, he is ready for his close up, Mr. DeVille. He is ready to go to the park. So I hope y'all like this tutorial on how to make these cute little Halloween cupcakes. And my cute little Halloween friends here. So from Skeleton Mummy and Jack and I, I hope you guys have a fun and safe Halloween. Alright guys, make sure y'all to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Also, share my other videos that I have, guys. Remember to always love a sleep life. So, love, peace, and sleep.